In this video, we'll be doing a geometry word problem. Now, the first step when you have to work a word problem is to read and analyze the problem. The problem that we'll be working with is the length of a rectangle is two inches more than the width. If the length and the width are each increased by three inches, the perimeter of the new rectangle will be four inches less than eight times the width of the original rectangle. Find the dimensions of the original rectangle. So what we have then is an original rectangle. And then a new rectangle. And it helps to uh, draw a picture um, so that you can assign variables. So we have an original rectangle and then a new rectangle in which the length and width are increased. So my new one is going to be a little bit bigger than my original. All right, for our given information, let's just look at this first sentence. It says the length is two more than the width. So I would let my variable be the width. And I'm going to let that be W. So my width, I'm going to label as W. And then the sentence actually says the length is, so it's telling us what to label our length as. The length is two more than W. So my length is two more than W. So now I have my variables for my original rectangle. Now let's look at the second sentence. If the length and the width are each increased by three inches. So that means then my new rectangle has a width which is W plus three because we're increasing by three. So my width of my new one is W plus three. And the length is also increased by three. So I need my original length which is 2 plus W, and then I want to increase that by 3. Now I can do the math here on this one. It looks like 2 plus 3 is 5, so my length is actually W plus 5. Now I haven't finished that sentence yet. It says, if this happens, the perimeter of the new rectangle, remember perimeter is the distance around. So I'm going to use the formula, but perimeter is two lengths plus two widths added together. So two times the length plus two times the width. And we're saying then that the perimeter will be, so the perimeter will be four inches less than, so four less than. Whenever you see the words less than, you've got to be careful. Scoot that uh, four over. So you're going to be subtracting four from something. So four less than eight times the width of the original rectangle. So four is subtracted from eight times the width of the original rectangle, which we said was W. Now I have enough information here to do some substituting. My length of my new one is here and this is the width of my new one and we know that 
the perimeter, I'm going to use this uh, formula. So I need 2 times, and then the length of this new one was w plus 5. And add to that 2 times the width, which is w plus 3. So this is my formula. This is my new rectangle, perimeter of my new rectangle. It was a translation of this sentence right here, 4 inches less than 8 times the width. And this is also the perimeter of my new rectangle. So since these expressions are both equal to the perimeter of my new rectangle, I can set them equal to each other. So I can write 8w minus 4 is equal to 2 times the quantity w plus 5 plus 2 times the quantity w plus 3. Now this gives me an equation that I can work with um, to find w. Um, let's distribute and remove these parentheses. I'll just copy the left side, 8w minus 4 equals, if I distribute here, I have 2w plus, and then 2 times 5 is 10. And then distribute here, I have 2w plus, and then 2 times 3 is 6. Let's combine like terms. I'll just copy on the left 8w minus 4 equals 2w plus 2w is 4w. And 10 plus 6 is 16. Subtract 4w from both sides. These will cancel. And 8w minus 4w is 4w. Just copy the minus 4. And on the right side, I still have 16. Um, then we can add 4 to both sides. These will cancel. So 4w is equal to 20. Divide both sides by 4, and w is equal to 5. Now our question asked for the dimensions of the original rectangle. So I know my width is 5. My length is going to be 2 plus w, or 2 plus 5. So I would say 2 plus 5 then is 7. So we can write then our answer. Um, these were inches, dimensions, were inches. And so my dimensions are 7 inches by 5 inches.